My name is Drew Bush and I'm the Executive Director at the Mount Washington Observatory. I'm here today really to talk to you about our organizational impact, um, which has been a really exciting year, my first here at the observatory. We've um, done quite a lot uh, in the areas of education, where we've launched all new school day programming, after school programming, and a suite of options, including field trips all the way up to the summit of Mount Washington for our school partners in the region. Uh, we even gave away more than 800 backpacks to school children this year to get them excited about what we're doing and to send home weather stations and NOAA cloud charts and other items. On the research side of the house, have built a whole number of new partnerships with our university partners, including a new diversity internship program that has brought Howard University students to the summit. We work very closely with Plymouth State University and our colleagues in meteorology. Um, Vermont State University, even the UMass system and UMaine and UNH. So having these university partners really allows us to get engaged in important research and to provide them with access to a very unique resource and accessibility on Mount Washington. A huge part of our mission is actually continuing our 91-year-old weather record with our hourly observations on the summit of Mount Washington as well as our twice daily forecasting um, this just has an important and huge role for the recreation and safety community where we're actually the backbone of emergency efforts and keeping people prepared when they come to our region to recreate. Beyond that, we spend a lot of time thinking about how our corporate partnerships can help build support for the observatory and provide us with the resources to carry out our mission. Um, of course, that starts with some of our key partners like the Mount Washington Auto Road and the Mount Washington Cog Railway both huge supporters of the observatory and really we wouldn't be able to function without them. One of our partnerships that's really been interesting has been with the United States Forest Service and the Mount Washington Avalanche Center that they run in, in cooperation with their own nonprofit. This project not only involves our Maisonette station supporting their work and interchanges of staff going between each organization, but in the coming winter, We'll actually have a joint internship as well. We realized that there really was just a lot of amazing synergy that we could be helping each other with both on the safety front in the White Mountains and on the forecasting and, and meteorological front and we're just so excited to see where it has reached to today and where it might go in the future. This year we are extremely fortunate thanks to the efforts of Congressman Pappas, Congresswoman Annie Custer, and Senator Shaheen to be able to have a northern border regional application get funded that will not only modernize the Mount Washington regional maisonette, but double its size. From collecting real-time data across the White Mountains in a varied topography, to being able to enable much more accurate forecasting on our parts, and then perhaps most importantly, giving our partners in the recreation, conservation, and safety communities, and even local businesses and towns, real data about how the climate will be changing locally and uh, information on how they can plan their own operations and investments so that our region really can be vibrant into the future. It's a real catalyst for all of the work that's getting done here in the Mount Washington Valley. Mount Washington Observatory is a private member supported nonprofit. We really couldn't do what we do without the support of all of our members. In fact, we're probably more reliant uh, than any nonprofit I know of on members to support us. More than half of our budget actually comes from your support. We're really working to secure the resources to build the observatory of the future, to make our operations more efficient, and to support the dreams of our staff and our members and our trustees to really enhance everything that we can offer. We hope as the holiday seasons come around and we get closer to year end that you might consider making a generous gift to help support what we do. Thank you so much.